The ants are back. How are you guys still spawning in our face? Were you the one that was stuck underneath the platform and they just spawned you up? We must be we must have built right on top of one of their spawn points or something. I'm getting that walleye vision thing again. Hang on. Options Display Field of View down to there. Apply. And then turn it back up. So welcome, welcome everyone on stream. Oh. <laughs> Zoom tight. Uh. It's allergy season, yay. Mm. Um, game? Also, can I say how awesome this game is, where I could just go into my inventory while standing sort of near our, like, supply cache, and just fix everything in my inventory? Don't even need to boil it. Like, it just pulls the resources, I don't have to go digging through chests for them. It's a really nice thing. Hey, Zug. <laughs> uh, doing good on healing bandages, but I will not say no. Yeah, you have an icon sound. over your... your uh... Ow! Oh, you're, you're testing the uh, countdown timer update? Yes, I'm, I'm yeah, assuming I don't you're have testing a... it, yeah. Yeah, I'm testing the countdown timer thing. So it's not an actual t clock, it's a bar that I can see ticking down. Oh, okay. Peter, hang in there. You're gonna be okay. So hello, everybody. Do you have your uh, reliable friend three attached? Because it seems You're gonna be okay. slower to revive now. I probably don't have it. I mean, oh my God, I'm alive. status. Oh, I have I natural it. explorer, cardio friend, friend, and grass master. I don't have reliable friend up. Also, one thing we might want to do um, wow. is the fresh defense when we head over to the uh, gas area later. Um, will handle burns and stuff. So it might not be a uh, bad perk to have on if we get hit by, like, a bombardier beetle. It might give us some resistance. Gotcha. Uh, berry That's leather is in the tough materials. And then grab some more berries. Man, these drying racks are super good that we don't have to waste berry leather three to one. That takes a lot longer to gather. <laughs> it does. And you can't do the dirty water trick anymore. Oh yeah, I guess Terraria did have the uh, proximity chest thing. I'm thinking it was like a new advance this game made, but like a lot of games should take, you know, take the note and do that as well, because it's good. <laughs> yeah, so today our goals, we have three goals. We want to go to the pond depths and see what's going on with the pond. We want to go over to the beehive, over by the picnic table. That shed is new, so I don't know if we can go over to that yet. But I know there's a picnic table over that way, and then there's the gas fields. Oh, the pond is blue on the map now. Has it always been blue? I think so. Wow, there's a cave down here, ghost. Oh, shit, you're already in the water. All right. Of course I'm already in the water. Let me get my flippers on. Oh, I already am wearing them. Come on, give me an air bubble. Thank you. Oh, that scared me for a second. Oh. I was like, what the hell is that? Reach the pond depths. Nice. Oh, I see a water spider near you. Oh. Oh, this is really deep. Oh, when you eat, uh... Oh, that's what is spider. attacking me? Spider. Oh, okay. I just got one shot. I don't think I was at full HP. No. Oh, I insta died. Well, I can't get you up if you're dead, dead. Yeah, that's. Wow. Okay, good news. It did keep my uh, oxygen mask on, so that's good. Wow. I was not expecting to just. Insta give right there. Oh, it's following you. Oh, 
Okay, I must just been on low health. You were from when I hammered you. Ah, I didn't heal. Okay, my bad. Ah, oh, damn it. Okay, that time I didn't instant. No, I didn't die. Oh, because it turns your runs your oxygen out. Mm. When you're down. Because otherwise you could breathe forever by just knocking each other out. I see. I feel a little less squishy now. Okay, well that is really hurting my durability. So maybe I should leave that spider alone the next time we go down. All right. Well, I need to go find my other bag. Oh, oops. I'm eating food when I don't have to. I'm at half health. Oh, because I got nibbled on by the spider. Also, welcome, Jacob, Anastasia, Crystal Dragon. How's it going? Good to see ya. Joining in for some grounded fun. Bubble, bubble, bubble. I don't bubble, think bubble. you missed anything, Sharpshooter. Uh, we, we had a week off because real life was uh, less than kind. It goes that way. But we are exploring the pond. Give me my loot back. There we go. Oh, wow. It is dark as crap down here. Um, I should probably have made a water torch. Oh, giant T-Rex toy. Yeah, that gave me a bit of a start when I first went through. And some awesome go, science. Go. That's a welcome, Waluigi. Oh, there's a rotten stinger spear. Waluigi, thank you for the follow. Is that a new research? That's researchable. Welcome, nice. welcome. Oh, and I see the cave over there that it wants us to go to. Oh, shit, I need an air bubble. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Give me another air bubble. Okay, we're good. All right. Is that I need a to horizontal go... air bubble? Or a current? Oh, it's a current! Oh. It's a current! All right, did you go down? You're down in the pond depths? Yep. There's a current in there somewhere. All right. And high ping. Lovely. All right, I'm going to go and make some torches for underwater. And maybe repair some gear, because this needs to not be broken. Yeah, that's pretty cheap to repair. Oh, please don't die. Please don't die. Okay, that one I can't repair. Um, underwater torches. I made it with three seconds left. Nice. Oh, my God. Before you catch that current, make sure you have air. Gotcha. Well, Luigi, welcome. I'm nearly suffocating myself. Hey, turtle, welcome. Glad you enjoy the videos. Dagger. Craft. I don't think I have any slime mold for torches for a slime torch. Uh, I'm going to bring a couple torches down, so I should make a few more. We have a bunch in the thing. Yeah, we have a bunch of slime mold. I just had to go get some plant fiber. We are on battery backup. Oh, the you found a lab? Oh, yeah. Ham's test, day one. Um, Initial diagnostics indicate that everything is working order, ready to begin Brussels sprouts live testing phase using the automated hydroponic aquaculture microponic system, HAMS. I suppose going forward. Burgle's task of cultivating the bio... Biodome mycelium network seems to have not been a complete failure, and signals are detectable at, in all extremities. Oh. Fungal network's active, surprisingly. Harvest is typically 90 days out, but initial tests show small sprouts are ready within the span of a week. We have to optimize that further. Keep in mind, certain level of structural integrity is required to scale them up to nearly a grapefruit size. Interesting. I wonder if they're, like, better... Um, Why am I getting such bad Mushroom pain? things. All right, six torches should be enough. Wow! Why do I hear an ant? Uh, I just got knocked out by a robot. Oh, um, shit, I'm not going to be able to get all the way there in time. 
I assumed you were on your way. I, I had to go run around and grab plant fibers in order to get stuff, so if you want to just knock yourself out and then I'll guide you back. Come with you, I guard. I see how it is. I, well, I have no idea where the entrance to that current even is. So. It's in the hole. Yeah. Okay, apparently I went back to the very beginning. Oh. Maybe you unset your spawn point? I have no idea. I'm a little safer now. All right, I'll run over with you. But yeah, they made lots of game changes, so I really do enjoy the uh, the respawn timer. That one I think will make it really good. Ooh, just started screaming, Miguel. Nice, nice. I hope things go well for you. I'm doing okay. I got wiped out. Today was market day for our house, so we had to go to the supermarket, and they didn't have their AC working, so it was really, really hot. And it was a big shop this week for us. Well, we shop every two weeks, so... Mm. We usually do a pretty big haul when we go to the supermarket, and we felt it. And it being the first of the month, this is when we double check our, our freezer. So we had to rotate some stuff out of that that it got started to be in there too long. Have you... That's a spider. I don't want a spider. Yep, new music for the spiders. Oh, I'm running. Or are you running from the spider? Oh, I'm running from the spider. I got... I, I, I... Don't see a need to fight it. Okay. I'm also noticing something. Hmm. I'm not seeing the blue signpost for our base. Oh, shit. They must have redone waypoint markers? Yeah, no. All of our waypoints are gone. All right. Well, uh, it's over this way to the left more. Uh, I guess we'll remake some of those. So it means we need some clover... Yeah, there's the can. Drop some of this gnat meat. But how about you, Yoshi? You having a good day? Life treating you all right? Wish I knew why my ping was going all over the place. All right, set spawn point. Well, the good news is I think we mostly know where the bases are, but yeah, it kind of sucks losing some of those markers. Yeah, our signs are gone. I wonder if they... No? Oh, trail... No, trail markers, same as usual. We need some plant fiber... Congratulations! Getting a raise at work is always good news. Ooh, excellent news, yeah. Put that stinger spear in there. Two sprayed, two plant, one clover. I can get that, maybe. Alright. Oh, cool! They added new symbols and stuff, too. So this is blue base. They added like caves, you can do burgle, there's like... Yeah, and supposedly if stuff is unsupported, it tells you why you can't place a, a piece down now. Oh, nice! Like, you know, hey, you're missing foundation, or you're stupid, don't build inside of a rock. All I don't think that's actually a tool know. tip, but... Oh. I need to get my stuff, but I don't think I have... Uh, you should still have your. Water I have my gear. gill tube in my fins, so I'm okay on that. Yeah, um, give me a second. Let me just repair my diving knife. Um, there's some food here if you need to get some uh, nat roast. So if I can get my body, I got. I mean, I got everything I need. I just want to be able to get to it. Oh, and then here you go. Um... Well, honestly, it's not that dark once you get towards the right thing. Oh. Well, I made far too many slime mold torches. 
We had a bunch, they're, didn't they're, we? We didn't make them into torches, we just had the slime molds, but those are actual torches. Okay. So I think the bow is not going to be much use underwater. Oh, I am not wearing my flippers or my rebreather. I feel a little less squishy now. I got less armor now. I feel less squishy. <laughs> Pete, you're a dumb, smart person. <laughs> Head towards the left of the dinosaur. Left of the dinosaur. Yeah, that big open water area. Or the glowy area that's designed. Yeah, you'll to see it. You'll attention. see a trail of bubbles that gives you a, a current. Okay. Oh, I see it. Yep. Yeah. Is there a bubble spot down here for error or no? Yeah, it just. Swim to me. Oh, I found some sunken bones. Cool. You may want to swim to me and get air before you suffocate. Ghost. Yeah, I know. I got 40 seconds, so I'm not going to All right. Open. Well, I won't lay, linger and die again, so you can get air. Underwater base. Because I want all my stuff back. Is there an air pocket somewhere in here? Yeah, that's what I was trying to show you so you would know where it is so you could go. And then I figured you could loot, but... Okay, I'm like right behind you. Where's the air pocket? Oh, I didn't go far enough. Derp. Okay, yeah, so uh, that's 15 seconds left. So that was getting a little on the close side. I was trying to tell you to come and you're all like, hey, loot. I'm Ghost. Loot. All right, power grid control. Looks like we have three batteries we need to connect. Yeah, I gotta go kill the thing that killed me. It's behind this door. It made me mad. Oh, he tried. He tried so hard. That should keep me safe. Um, excuse me? Ah. Fur. Revenge has been satisfied. Yeah, sadly there was like no sound effect for me hitting them, so I couldn't tell if I was actually hitting. Ooh, more tests and some bandages. Oh, was, you can set this as a spawn point. What? Oh. Um, I actually think that would be a good idea. Uh, do you want those bandages? Light. Burn back the shadows and turn away the inky depths of the night. So I've got a full stack of ten. Also, you may want to throw your physic uh, gear on if you... If we're I didn't bring it. Ah, okay. Just pretend it's beef jerky. That's yeah. a lot to ghost. Okay. I but think yeah. we're gonna have to be doing moon pools and stuff like this. Cause see, look down there. Yeah. And if we get those sunken bones, those are. Oh, a... this is glass. Yeah, those are a research tech to get us more stuff. Feeling a little safer now. But the good news is there is a lot of... Oh, there's just straight boatman fins and stuff down in here. This is a good little place to leave sitting around. A lot of good resources. Berry leather, everything down here. Why am I only at 25 seconds? Oh, because I never put my rebreather on. I, feel a little I less put my... Now. There we go. I highly recommend putting on your breather. I don't need a shovel down here. Where'd my knife go? Oh, it's in my hand. Okay. Oh, there's a current there. Can't do that way. Okay. Down to 30 seconds. I'm going back to where I know there is air. Yep, probably a smart plan. Basically, it's going to come down to figuring out where all our air spots are and just going yep. point to point. Let there be light. Oh, they actually gave us a lot of the uh, light things down here. Wait, is that just... Haha! -ha! There was just a piece of sunken bone on the, the little <laughs> lever there, so... If we can find a scanner thing... I wish we had room for... Uh chest or something down here, but <laughs> I'm glad you found that air pocket. Is 
There's like a whole other cave system around here. Turn dial. That's sealed. That's all sealed. Oh, hey, I got 30 I seconds. Don't, yeah, I was going to say, I don't think I see any air pockets in this other part of the base. Also, I'm not 100% certain you can get into it. Oh, I mean, there's got to be a way. Yeah. Okay. Oh, shift will let you swim a little bit faster. Yep. Sucks your stamina down fast. I don't know if it makes your oxygen go faster. No, oxygen's measured in seconds. I'm sitting so. up straight, Yoshi, I promise. And you become a moderator on a channel by the owner of the channel making you one. Hey, Flashcraft. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Flash. What? Oh, because I'm stuck on a chair. Can I? Was I moving that chair? No. All right, let's drink some water. I mean, this is probably what bottled water is. And also, the torches I made aren't the crappy torches. Uh, they're the underwater ones. We haven't. I don't think we unlocked yeah, the, the, the better underwater ones yet. So since we explored the depths, question mark. Muddy scale. Huh. Koi fish scale. Oop, that's a current. Ow. Okay, this looks like a battery hatch. Oh, that's a spider. Turn dial. Oh, okay, I think I found where the batteries are. It's those uh, giant yellow things. Oh, I found a second one. Were you able to turn bulb. the dial? I, I was I, that one, but it wouldn't let me turn it. Um, it didn't let. I like I pushed the button, but I also decided to swim away because of oxygen. So it might let me. Because I saw three of them, but they're all in the ready position. Nice and clean. Because there's the one right underneath us here. Ooh, the koi fish scales are apparently armor, so that might be a much stronger armor. Also, there are cables along the ceiling from the battery hatch that you can follow that takes you to the batteries. Well, that's if you want to be smart about it. Yeah, it says turn dial, but it doesn't let me turn the dial. Go away, spider. There's another one coming. Also, we're getting low in air. Probably a tactical retreat time. God, it's just, there's just so, like, even with the gear, it's so hard to uh, get anywhere with the timer we got. Yeah, we need, like, a serious rebreather or something. Or just anything that gives bubbles that isn't this base. <sighs> yeah, that was close. Because, yeah, I was on this one right here that's below the glass window, and it wouldn't let me turn it. But it's in the right spot, so... I don't know. May oh, maybe you have to, like, tap it? Or, hold on. Power grid control. Pull. Switch on all the breakers. Oh, okay, we had we, it wouldn't let us turn it because uh, we didn't... You just locked me in. No, you didn't. I'm just dumb. Yeah, so it, it wouldn't let us turn them because we didn't turn the thing. Oh, see, all the breakers them. flipped when it turned on. Yeah. Flipped down. Okay, now we can go do that. So one of them is inside that other thing. That giant lab part. So I don't know the best way to you get You go to for that. the easy one, I'll go for the spider one? Um, alright. I'll just go to this one real quick and then I'll join you over at the spiders for backup. And then we'll figure out a way into the other thing. Uh, pretty much I get moderator to those who I feel are going to be... Green light. ...good about policing the channel... Uh, showing up obviously is good and helpful. I wouldn't say no. There we go. That turned the dial. Okay, you got a spider. Oh, there are you. two spiders down yeah, here. Yeah, that's what I was saying. The other one's coming for backup. Now, this one is inside 
this device, which I don't see a broken But now window. that the power's switched off, maybe the current's turned off and we can swim through there now. Oh, I hadn't considered that the currents were powered by the same circuit. That's a good point. Also, you can, just, you can just hold shift, and then yeah. when your stamina runs out, you slow down and it lets you refill, so you don't even have to focus on it. Well, that's a good policy to have, Yoshi, so also, yeah. welcome, Wraith Dante. Um... All right, you try it that way. I'm going to explore this back cave area and see if there's another entrance into that pipe. Yeah, the current's... Nope. Oh, the current is periodic. Oh, it's a timing thing. Okay. okay there just seems to be a giant, like, ah! water spider area over here. All right, uh, oxygen time. Unless you see a bubble somewhere in there. Uh, whoa. I can't see. I got turned around. Where's my light? Am I going to drown? Hopefully not. Yeah, I probably am. Where is my slime old torch? Hey, Zephyr. Five, well, four, no. three, two, one, dead. Aw. Well, the business, you know, is currently underwater. So, you know, little concern there. I was able to swim out some. I got turned around and, like, I don't know, couldn't see anything. So, do you know when the current is, or...? No, I, I could almost get there. Clearly, you have to really time it. Oh, there's an e easier entrance. There's a missing panel that you can get there closer. Did I lose all my stuff? Yeah, where's my stuff? Where's my pack? Got it. Breaker's That's been nice. Flipped. Where's my pack? Uh, it rolled down farther. Oh, it sank. Gotcha. No, it's not a halfway point. Oh, I'm going to die. I need to get out of here so it doesn't get lost in here. Yep, 11. Yeah. Swim faster. Nice song reference there, uh, Micra. It's getting dark. No, I was so close. Well, I, I, I managed to get the breaker, so... Pull the lever! It just wants to know if I want to slurp nasty water. I don't know. Power managed remotely. Oh, the button is in the little area in the middle. It's that, like, latch on the top of the roof, I think, is where we had to go and push it. Yep. Oh, hey, now we have a nice central moon... Oh, you're right, it was a moon pool. I think it's this button here, maybe? Oh, that's a door button. Oh. Oh, that's cool. It's like an automatic moon pool. Wait, is this just back to the bedroom? It is, but this door's open now. This is science. Did have a good Easter. Need to get some discount discount Easter candy though. Oh, that's cool. Mm-hmm. Plumped up. Okay. Onions and stuff. Garlic maybe. I don't know. There's like oh, this is the Brussels sprouts experiment. That was the whole point of this whole area. Well, I did just find a new note. I think there was one earlier that I found on the bed that I didn't read. So where does this go? Looks. Goes to another tunnel. Why am I not pulling out my torch? Alright, where are my notes? Data. 
Um, Ham's test day 15. No change from last week, but I feel like custom something here. Got an idea. Sh shot awake early this morning, sweating with the memory of frantic energy of fitness infomercials that popped on before the kids' Saturday morning cartoon shows. Those early hours being annoyed at the greasy glow of skin stretched tight over bursting muscles, screaming about some new trivial invention, veins bulging with hot blood. But that movement and excitement, that's what I was missing. Our wilted pettis clue needs to get pumped up. With this inspiration, we're moving forward to our admittedly odd Hail Mary procedure for generating two vascular grafting. At the time of this, we're removing some cumbersome stem from the growth process, rendering those auxiliary buds longing for a new system to be part of. I've had Burgle harvest the appendicular artery off the old Jared appendix, and have begun splicing them into sprout roots, mending the union with a manner of auger glue. The system of both man and plant are not that different, after all, but could they be this compatible? Okay, they're so making ghost? some weird... Hybrids. You gave me slime mold stocks, not an underwater torch. Oh, my bad. Um, that would probably here you go. That would probably help a little bit. That or I burned up my torch, but I didn't have stocks before, and then I had stocks. So, let's see. Generation seven fitness stable. Vascular systems involved in something inspirational. Sprout musculature Just amplification research is going swimmingly. Gen four being taught the rhythm Thanks, of the Jacob. flesh in a way the fungal networks could transmit was certainly key. Each node performing in tandem, peak efficiency, dense crop cycle manipulation, so it's fast growing, super dense Brussels sprouts, muscle sprouts, conducting a ripe symphony of proteins, lipid, and carbohydrates, being the push and pull of plant and muscle fibers. Application here for sustainable, humane, omnivorous diets are tantalizing. Consider an aerobics program for the lab to monitor array plant data into Burgle's recipe module, our plug data, finally something we can share a common bond over. <gasps> if we get, the, uh, if we find something in this lab and give it to Burgle, we'll get muscles. Cool. Uh, well, uh, yeah. Uh, thanks for stopping by, Yoshi. And also, uh, I don't know why I'm getting high ping off Ghost today. Oh, I don't know sorry. if it's just heavier traffic than normal or what. Maybe it's just the water effects. Yeah, I don't, ha I don't have lag on me, but... Also, hey, Reaper. Yeah, this doesn't seem dangerous at all. I know, right? We can't both swim through there at the same time, Ghost. I'm sorry. I was trying to utilize your light. Oh, hi, Spider. Yeah. Bye, Spider. Ghost! Oh, I'm sorry. Stop! I'm, oh, I'm going to kill you, literally. I'm sorry. Ow. Someone help me. Peter, hang in there. You're going to be okay. See, on my screen you were definitely well away from me, but the lag definitely, yeah, I need to be careful with No, I couldn't. Water. I kept getting frozen in the hallway cuz he kept trying to sprint and swim past me and Reboot Biodome Terminal. Okay, Biodome Access Ramp Pond Hatch. Oh, cool, there's like a, maybe a shortcut. Granola bars. Omniant Log. Omniant Practical Technologies, Dr. Wendell Tolley, Science Division. Log 88.06.23A. Finally, my genius is recognized. My Omniant Minders have requested a demonstration of the spacer. I do wonder how they even found out about it. No doubt it was the loose lips of that blabbing Klein. But perhaps his indiscretion worked in my favor in this instance, and I will have the last laugh. Once Omnit sees what I've accomplished here, I will prove that their many years of investment in me was not a mistake. How it will feel to have them watch me in my moment of triumph. This is what I've been working toward my entire career. Recognition at last. No water filtration tablets needed. What do you want to bet they uh, saw him show off his shrink ray and oh? Ah. I need some assistance. Oh, there were two of them. And then they just shrunk him. Willow. Probably. Willow. Oh, damn it. Willow. Yeah, it really does look like it's completely filled. Yeah, it looks like it's done, it but it fills the, like, stylized trend, but there's actually more behind that, yeah. Oh, 
we got a moon pool access. Nice, nice. This oh, is, the, we're in the same room this, we were in earlier. This is the moon pool hub, yeah. Muscle Sprout Test Kitchen, Dr. Wendell Tully. Ingredient assessment. Test samples are currently at 0.833% of target production size, complex of somewhat tense muscle, muscular nuggets. Several flaps overlap to protect a central organ, all entirely edible. An innate sense of fitness and survival compels them to fight against preparation. A smack of the spatula calms them right down. Oh. Wait, we're gonna Initial have like a recipe plant module any? analysis indicates use of a replacement for dry aged beef liver. Unexpected! Compiling flavor profile compatibility. Can oh. you not see the stream? There's an upstairs. What's wrong, Apazia? Where'd you go, ghost? Uh, there's an oh. upstairs. It, it just opened up. Worse than my mom's Brussels sprouts. Over here on the other side of the moon pool. I was wondering if we'd gone upstairs before, so I was like, wandering. Yeah, I need to go check some things out with a scanner. Hey, but... did you notice the footprints? What? Footprints. Oh, shit. No, I did not notice that. Okay, we're on the right trail then. Oh, we got like a lab in here. <laughs> Thank you for the bit! I greatly... Oh my gosh, I forgot to heal. Willow! Willow! I gotcha. Hey, look, there's a scanner over there, too. I was sure nice. that was the end. And a new burgle! Or a new scab thing. Shallows. Oh, this is the biodome! Also, I can analyze the toy scale. And bone I found earlier. Koi armor. This is probably like top tier armor. Aquatic armor, yeah. Bubble helmet. Oh, is that that maybe the thing we needed to learn to go farther? Oh, more hands. Hams test day seven. Nominal results, not even marginally different from the initial pretest runs. Nitrogen cycle levels remains optimal, and the local fungal network appears robust. Brussels spouts seem slightly loose and fairly lump, limp. Uh, they need something to promote growth, but I can't put my finger on it. Other phalangeal observations, Trudy finds her ring better suited for the koi pond sub sub substrate than her hand. Work on making uh, calls to the house. Take Burgle to fish that ring out of the pond. Okay, so that's cool. Also, you basically get samurai armor from the Koi Scales, which gets you increased perfect block. Um, and then the Bubble Helmet is v Expert Diver. Right now, the little uh, breather tube is Junior Diver. Gotcha. So we need ten total sunken bones. I have one, and I think there was some more back in the supply room. Muscle Sprout. Oh, sweet. I wonder if this just, like, regrows them. I don't know. Light went away, and I don't want to use my slime mold torch. Ghost is gobbling up all the loot. I started to gobble. I know, right? Sorry. You know what we do to loot these, right? No! No, no more mint mace. No. No! <laughs> The dead end goes. Ow! There's a burgle chip. With my last breath, I loot more. You can see me in the dark. Oh no, you can. Never mind. There's a big name over your head, ghost. More loot. <coughs> mm, excuse me. I like how. The uh, the prompt up here for the password. Catch my like check it out before you push it. You're gonna be okay. One tiny beat, back in the game. Look, look what the prompt is. Mash keys. Yeah. yeah. Hey. Ooh. Oh shit! Look at that. At least it's clean. Wait, are we rising up? No, it was just opening. Good thing I'm hungry. Oh, there's the there's the koi. 
Does this give us, like, just a pretty fancy dome thing? Or do we actually get some, like, access Don't forget to, to heal this? up. Oh, thank you. Got some, like, beefy muscle commercials going on. Alright, let's see what this muscle thing is made out of. Oh, apparently we can't research it. Invalid object. But I think I saw in the patch notes that this is a smoothie component, so... Restores hunger when eaten, but also causes pain. Hmm. There's also some hidden science somewhere down here. Oh, is this like the uh, ray guns? Interesting. Alright, so we should probably clean out all the good stuff in that warehouse, head back to the surface, and see if we can't make the better diving helmets. Uh, warehouse is, I think, this door. Nope, wrong way. Got some more koi scales. Get some more of these flipper parts so we don't have to chase those things down. Ooh, spider bell chunks, okay. Got some eelgrass. Oh, is this just all water resources? Oh, hell yes. Rotten Slime Lantern. Ooh, that's new. This is where we came in, Ghost. This yeah. is the same room we discovered earlier. I know. Okay. But I didn't realize that all the stuff on the shelf were water resources, which, you know, it's really Yeah, I know nice there's that... diving bell spider stuff and all that. Kill soldier ants, complete marker at Stepping Stone Summit. Alright, so the Rotten Slime Lantern. <laughs> we need to research so we can probably learn the Slime Lantern. Uh, do you have any bone chunks or diving bell spider chunks on you? Uh... Don't think so, no. Okay, um, loot what you have room for. I'm gonna fill myself with berry leather. There's some, like, spider silk over here. Silk rope. Uh, I'm gonna go run back up to the scanner. But yeah, there's four doors. This one just goes... This one goes to this dead-end room. Doesn't go anywhere. This one goes to the... secondary side of that water tunnel. Did we fully explore this Can place? I, I think we that? did. Yeah, this is a, the like main computer lab. By the power of Helion. Oh, this Champion is where we came sun. in. Hmm. Hold on, there might be other areas we didn't explore yet. I don't know where that water goes out to. First, we need to find the upstairs lab to use another scanner charge so it'll recharge while we're waiting. And so I don't have to carry this lantern around. Really? What's the deal? Oh, we already knew that slime lantern, but 20 science is 20 science. Wonder if it's. Oh, yeah. Okay, the Slime Lantern is, like, the better torch. Okay, so we did know better torches, and I just didn't make them. Okay, this is where we went down the first time. So it must come up. It comes up over, over here. Over here, okay. So yeah, we have explored all of the uh, water paths then. There's still a spider in there, and I didn't carefully search the room the spider's in. Yeah. Nice and clean. Oh. Ow. Oh, 
Oh, yep, there's a secret. My torch died. Okay, I, I've got the diving bell lamp. I just need to get some air real quick. But there's, uh, get your shovel on your hotbar. There's a four thing of clay that's blocking away to another uh, burgle thing. I don't have any lamps left, Ghost. It's yep. pitch black down there. I know. But I'm going to need your help, like, mining through this. Well, that's what I'm saying, Ghost. It's dark. I can't see. I have no lamps left. See if I can make anything. I mean, I'm happy to help, but if I'm in the dark, I'm just going to drown. All right, I got it. Yes, 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 yes. I know all these things. All right, looks like that was all the secret stuff. Yeah, these uh, diving lanterns are what we should be making. They're lasting like five times as long. I have parts and pieces if you need some to make one. They really need a search for uh, their tools and That stuff. would be a nice upgrade, yeah. I think it's a workbench tool probably or something. Or Yeah, it's a workbench tool. Yeah, slime lantern. It takes four lily pad wax. Yep. All right. Well, let's go out the moon pool and... Uh... I don't know if we want to explore the rest of the depths, or head up. I mean, we only explored, like, that one hole. I don't know if we've really looked around other than that. Yeah. There was a lot of bones on the bottom, and uh, we need a lot of the bones to uh, get stuff for... That's uh, not so bad. Is this a different part? No, okay. Yeah. No, this is where we came in. Oh, spider again. My flippers break or something? No. Okay, spider, are we going to have problems? Is this what we're going to have to be? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shovel, sunken bone. On air bubbles. Ow. Ooh, that hurt a lot. Okay. To the moon pool. Oh, thank God it auto-activates from underneath. Yeah. There we go. Go away, okay, spider. Okay, smoothies are going to be a new, like, requirement when uh, exploring. Because uh, that healing is kind of needed. There's an ant under the water. Man, they are just getting themselves all sorts of places. Oh, yeah, there's lots of bone chunks down here. Hey, I just got Ant Annihilator too. Nice. I also have to remember that there is a uh, there's a water jet on the bottom of the pond that'll send you right up into the uh, moon pool. Good to know. Is there anything in here that I needed to find? No. So it's like the fastest shortcut to the air. Water droplets actually seem to be a little harder to see now. A little less obvious. They, they, they're a lot more, like, shiny, yeah. Yeah. Oh. That's convenient. Yeah, so I guess the uh, little water jet things is something we should have been utilizing the entire time. Because they, like, push you towards the air pockets. Gotcha. 
and we were just not using them. I'm sorry, Apazia. Is it Apazia or Apazia? I'm guessing it's a soft A sound. There was an unexplored door by the scanner? I thought I explored that. I will go back and double check. Yeah, I would have been happy to explore more. I just had to get to a, a, a vault to unload. Yeah. That and to make some lanterns and stuff. Yeah, see if you can make that new diving helmet. Oh, uh, let's see. Because that'll uh, make you... I, that'll probably give you way longer. Slime lantern. Craft. Let's craft two of those. Diving helmet? Yeah. Is that, I'm guessing, a work... Is that a... Yeah, it's probably gear? workbench. I, I figured you were back at base. I don't know. Yeah. Oh, yeah, look at that. There is an unexplored door that... I bet you this shortcut's just back into the other area. Oh, no. It's another moon pool. Oh, okay. This is actually... I will wait for you. But some, some, some science. It takes uh, five sunken bones that I don't have. Okay, I've got those. I've got division. seven. Log 88.07.01. First test demonstration of the spacer. Director Hubert Picon in attendance. Begin recording. Everyone, thank you for coming. Today, I will show you nothing less than a quantum leap forward in technology. This is the spacer. It is a machine that has the power to shrink any object many times over, unleashing the power of the miniature world. Now, I'm sure that some of you will be skeptical, but I have no doubt that a demonstration of this device will show you a vision of the future. Of Ominent's future. Of our future. Now, if you Ominent want, isn't like an evil goggles, villain company name at all. Nope. Not Behold, ominous at all. The future! Thank you for the captioning of disappointing sound of mechanical failure. I assure you. Just give me a moment. I, I can fix this. I can fix this. I think he's trying to tell him he can fix it. <laughs> oh shit, that's an actual treasure chest. Oh boy. Okay, I see the air bubble. Gotta go straight for it. Gotta go fast. The T-Rex looks so cool coming back out of that tunnel. It does. I finally have a lantern now, so... Come on, Yeah, I have enough fish bones, I think, for both of us. Give me a bubble! Give me a bubble! Give me a bubble! There it is. That was close. Uh, do I have enough fish bones? No, I'm one short. Do you have one fish bone on you or no? Because I saw one. I... Got a fish bone? Nope. No, but I can go get a shovel and dig it up. Oh, I found one. All right, now I have enough for two helmets for both of us. So we'll head back to base, get the better helmets, then come back down and explore the mysterious door and passageway. And maybe whatever else is down here, because now that we have the diving lanterns, we can see the way better. Also, the rest of the pond looks super crystal clear now. This wax? Can you harvest this? I think it's just the stuff on the bottom of the lily pads that we can touch. Also, what is your uh, diving fin's uh, durability? Uh, two thirds. Okay, because I need to repair those. I got four more boatman fins from that treasure chest down there, so. Sure. It's probably good to have everything topped off. Kind of organize things here. I think the muscle sprouts are good for smoothies. These are hard scales, so they'll go in here. Bones will go in here. Berry leather. Um, plant fibers and rope. All right, cool. I'm organized. Let's make a couple helmets. You want me to make one for you, or are you going to make yours? Uh, I can probably make mine. Okay. 
Boom. Let's see, that's probably under tools, I'm guessing. Uh, oh, workbench under, gear. Uh, gear. Feeling a little safer now. Yeah, so it replaces your gill tube, so I guess you could just stick the gill tube in the gear chest. If there's room. Well, don't forget, I've made those chests over by the drink box. That one was supposed to be for each of us, mm. so for personal gear. Put that on. Put the tube in there. No water filtration tablets needed. Should. I guess that would technically work if you had an air bubble under there. Yeah. Better than starting. Oh yeah. I Two minutes of of uh, dive time. Oh, that's real nice. Hey, you know what? Before I go underwater, I'm gonna go ahead and eat a little food and drink a little drink. I was gonna say, yeah, get some. Uh... Come on. There's a nat roast for you on the spit. Yummy, yummy, nat roast. That is surprisingly not Fairy terrible. leather working. Yeah, I the second drying rack was a good idea. Yeah. I suspect in time we'll get even a third or so. Top off your healing. Um, let's see, koi fish armor. How much does it take to make that? Chess piece requires more sunken bones. Okay, so we need sunken bones and koi scale. But uh, it gives, what, a bar and a half of defense? Is that better than... Okay, the ladybug gives triple. Okay, so ladybug's definitely one to hunt with. And we definitely want to look at making... We need to find some more crow feathers to get a marksman cap each for when we go fight the bees. Because it'll up our damage with bows. But I think for now, back to the pond. Yeah. Spot. Aha! Lunch. Oh, sorry. It's all good. I wanted to see how fast stuff grows now, so I was chopping down some grass just to see. Oh, uh, okay. That, and we're going to need it to build up our home. Yep. All right. One more exploration to go explore that spooky tunnel by the secret door. Packing myself a lunch. I need to get my water bottle off my hot bar so I can get my shovel. I probably should repair this. Yeah, we can, we can afford that. And I'm going to repair my shovel even though I don't really need to. We've got stuff for it. We got a lot of fish bones to Spending gather. Spinning some rope. Mm, smart plan, smart plan. Looks like they made it easier to add things to the spinners now. Oh, nice. You can just highlight and click spacebar. I don't remember being able to do that. Sweet. Because it was always a bit of a pain to drag it. All right, let's see. So you said we need our shovel, possibly. Yeah. All right. Because if you see any fish bones or fish scales down on the bottom, grabbing them is a huge help. Oh my god, two minutes is wonderful. Don't forget, you might need to get... We should get some yield grass along the way, too. Yeah. I'm going to explore the floor around this T-Rex real quick, just to see if there's any more uh, bones and stuff down here. Yep, fish scales. Nice. 
Because if we can give ourselves, like, some better armor and stuff for underwater, that will definitely be a good thing. Light up a room. Oh I'm gonna swim in the T-Rex mouth. Light. Turn back the shadows and turn away the icky depths of the night. I think these lanterns actually have a longer, like, light range, too. I think they're they do. I think that might be all the freebie scales. Oh nope, there's one more. Oh, and one more. Just like blink my light on and off to make it last longer because I'm using the moldy one, so it has way less durability. Gotcha. All right, got some more koi scales. Oh, bones! Yes, they they float up. You have to grab them twice. Yeah. And there's the treasure chest. I think there's a way to open it though. Oh wait, hold on. Locked requires key. <gasps> Ghost I, has a new life goal. Yeah, no, I want into this treasure chest. Time to get some air, I think. I'm down to a... 50 seconds, yeah. A minute. Yeah, so we can just stay along the bottom, and you can just hit that jet, and it'll just, just launch you up there. It's so fun. Okay, so if there's a key, where would the key be? Hmm. I'm thinking it might be down here somewhere. Might be in that back spider area. I can see that. Whee! Ow. That would hurt. Yeah, it. that was a little bit more acceleration than planned. What the? No, don't. All right, now we need to find upstairs. That's not the one. This is the one. There was a door next to the scanner that we didn't... You're get. probably right. We should have gone to Burgle and gotten new missions and stuff. Ah, well, we can grab it. We can grab them after. Which way did this. you go? Up oh, this way. Uh, back to the moon pool room. They really don't... They need to, like, have labels for these doors, because I get lost so easy in these things. You got the footprint hallway is what you took. Do we have any new stuff to analyze? No. And then down here, there was a little uh, science thing and then a, that audio log back here. Pond hatch. Oh, it's a way in from the pond itself. Oh! Hey, it's a koi! Oh, hello there. Oh, fuck. Um, you stay there, Koi. It's missing an eye. Boss battle? I don't remember this big log thing here. Where the fuck are we? Oh, hi, Mosquito. The raven is on the feeder in the pond. Oh, okay, now I know where we are. Yeah. 